Ready? Okay, say hi. Hi. Uh, what's your name? Mommy. And what are we doing today? It's Monday. Like my mom. What kind of plane is it? Can you say Spitfire? Spitfire. Spitfire Mark 1. Spitfire Mark 1. Okay. Let's take your plane off here and I'll set it on the side. Okay? So that we can, everybody can open we can open the box up. Get the plane out. Okay? Okay. Now what's this? This is called a sprue. This is a sprue like that. And what part do you what part of the model do you want to work on first? A man. You want to work on the man first? Um, can Daddy cut it out? Mm-hmm. Okay. Let's cut it out. Hmm? Where's the man's arm? Oh, oh, Daddy dropped it. Can you get it? A bag. There he is. He's right there. I'll pick him up and put him on the table. Mm. Okay? Well, there's your man. It's my man. Okay. Um, you want the man's arm too? The man's arm's in this little red container. I got it right here. Okay. Okay, right here. Okay, the first thing we're going to do on this man is you see the little seam on the side? Mm -hmm. Right there from the mold. What I want you to do is take this little stick and you're going to rub on that seam. To get rid of it, okay? Just like that. Okay, can you do that? <laughs> Off? Yeah. Keep rubbing on it. Do you want Daddy to do it, or you want to keep working on it? Okay. Well, you're working on that. Daddy's going to get the destructions out and look at the steps for building the inside, okay? Welcome to um, Building a Spitfire with William. This um, series will last exactly as long as a five year old's attention span. Um, but right now, he desperately wants to build Daddy Spitfire, so we're going to build Daddy Spitfire, right? Okay. He's going to work on the, the um, man, and I'm going to get the interior out here a little off camera because, well, he's on camera. And my big um, camera's battery is dead, so I can't quite get the same fields of view as I can when it's running. We do have a uh, power supply on order for it, but um, it's not here yet today. Because mm. I was cheap and I bought the cheap one except instead of the one that was Amazon Prime, so I gotta wait a few more days for that to get here. Mm. So we're instead going to have to use batteries. How's the seam going? Are you blowing it off? That seam's starting to go away. You wanna work on the seam on his leg right there a little bit? Yes. It's two dots. You died today. Yep, it's, it's going to be on both sides of the man. The man's going to have a seam on both sides. You're right. Seat. Where is the seat? Five. I see a seat. Yep, Why there's a seat there? right here. I'm just cutting the seat out right now. Now my hands tired. Your hands are tired? Okay, then Daddy will sand that off a little bit, okay? And then maybe we can glue his arm on. You want to glue his arm on? He is. So tell everybody what you told Daddy about pajamas. What did Daddy tell you you had to have on, on to be on camera? Uh, and Daddy's are those and the water, those and them. All right, you have to have clothes to be on camera. And um, so what did you do? You went and put pajamas on? Yes, my dad did that my my dumb my big daddy bones and daddy bones you too. Yeah, they got dinosaur bones on them. Yes. Okay, daddy's got this man cleaned up as much as we're gonna clean it up on a kit that you're gonna work on. How's that? Okay, next we're gonna do some gluing. Can I see the arm for a second? See how the arm is? The arm's in pretty good shape. Or do we wanna wait to put the arm together? You know what? Maybe we'll glue the arm on when we put the guy in the cockpit with the um, with the seat instead. How does that sound? Because yeah. his arm's supposed to go on the control stick. Okay. 
and then it's a new wall. It's showing up there, and uh, in their room, and that the inventor in the make the wall. Um, let's see, what can you do? Shoot, I don't know how to do this model with you. This is the problem. Did you know that? Yeah. Daddy knows how to do these models, but he doesn't know how to do them with you. So are we going to paint this guy or not? Red is dead in the picture. Now paint him like in the picture? Mm hmm Um... Do you want to spray paint him or paint him with a brush? Yeah, brush. But brushes make hmm? a paint a whole bite too much. Painting a whole bite, maybe paint paint. Is is uh, I need a baby brush, a mice brush, a real that real bit mine. Hmm. Brushes. You don't feel big, my bosses. I don't have any of your brushes. They got daddy's brushes. What are those, daughters? Those are daddy's brushes. Let me no, I mean the red ones. I mean these bosses. Those? Oh, daddy did steal those from you. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> Dad. You can have them back. You want them back? You can have them back. Mm. Daddy bought some um, some cheap brushes of his own from Amazon. Yes, he did. So you can have your brushes back. You want your brushes back? Go ahead and take those out. There's one orange brush out. You've got another one there. Yep, those are both your brushes. You're all right. You spotted them. So you mm. can go use those to paint on your stuff. Now, those aren't very good for painting this stuff. You can paint this stuff with different brushes. Right. And you can use daddy's brushes to paint this stuff. Okay? So we use a brush more like this one. This is a number eight. I need a real one. A paint, real bit of paint. Okay. Let's see what the base coat is for this guy. The base coat for this guy is XF50, which is field blue. Field blue. Well, I don't know if we have XF50 field blue. In fact, I'm pretty sure we don't have XF50 field blue. I wonder what the closest thing is for XF50 field blue that Daddy would have. I got XF50 field blue coming in the mail, but it isn't here yet. Um, here, there. You want to paint him blue? You want to use this blue? Let's use this blue. Okay, so Daddy's gonna get a ball bearing out. He's gonna put in this 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 glue so we can shake it up, mix it up. Okay, and then you want to shake it. Yeah, you want to shake it. Yes, it's good there. Oh, I made the hole. I made the hole. I made the hole. So these are Vallejo paints. We've got some. Um, uh, um, 316 steel. 316 is a highly corrosion resistant steel. Stainless steel balls. We put those in our Vallejo paint in hopes of getting it to mix up. Can you hear the ball in there yet? When it hits? You want to shake it? Here, you shake it. Okay, and Daddy's going to get some tape out to put on. Um, I'm here for to put the paint on. Yeah. When you do that, you shake that, there's going to get some paint. Yeah. 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 Whoa, Bob! Whoa! What he was there for? This is what happens when a five-year-old tries to do a Tamiya 148 Spitfire. Yeah. You do it. I do it? Yeah. I already shook it a bunch. You want to try taking it out and see how it turns out on the on palette? Mm -hmm. Okay. Put some drops on. Oh, here. Oh, you want to put some drops on? Mm -hmm. Here. You can squeeze out some drops, okay? Just squeeze out some drops right there. Just okay. a little bit. Squeeze a little harder. Keep squeezing. Keep squeezing. Oh, there comes a drop. 
probably enough paint to paint this guy. Okay. All right, let's try painting him now. Okay, here's your brush. And what I want you to do is just dip the paint brush in the paint just real gently and put it on here. Let me find a toothpick and some white um, tack so that you don't get paint everywhere. Not that you're not going to get paint everywhere anyway, but that's okay. Not too big. So what we're doing this for, buddy, is so that you can hold the figure and paint him. Get a good hold on him. Put some white tack on the back of him just like that, yeah. And then we're going to stick a toothpick in the white tack. And you can hold on to the white tack with one hand and paint with the other. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. So go ahead, get a little paint on the tip of your brush. Yeah, that's good. And just start painting him. And paint him all over. Get him all blue, the whole thing. Can you move over so they can see you working on the camera? See, right there. Paint him blue everywhere. Maybe get a little more blue on your brush. Paint some more. Yep, you're doing good. Keep painting. I'm here. Mm -hmm. Got to get them all blue. The whole palette's got to be blue. I got all blue. And his what? What, Daddy? What? Yeah, you don't have to paint the white tack. You just paint him. It'd be too much for the whole body. Keep painting. Done. You want Daddy to work on him some too? Or how are you doing? Daddy, I'm making the paws. I'm making the horn. Got some, some, you're missing some on the inside of his leg there. And I brought his foot too. His foot too? Now it's my turn. Okay. Let me set my brush down real quick. Let's see if I can't get up the rest of it. He's kind of rotating on that peg. All right. Is die in his day? Hmm. How is die? How be die? How's he gonna dry? Well, we're just gonna stick him in a piece of styrofoam and let him dry. Why? Why? There? Right there? Yep, that piece of styrofoam right there. How a hand? A hand got the hole. Okay. A hand got the hole. Let me mount the hand on a toothpick and we can paint the, tooth, the, the, the hand next, okay? A hand, hand got a hole. Wait, tap go. Put it away. That's why I can't find it. No. Give me the arm and I'll stick it on the toothpick for you. No. It went. Give me a little white, give me a little white tack and it'll fall out of the hole. I'll okay. paint. Put the white tack on the end of the toothpick just like that. And then stick it in the other arm. 
Yeah. I don't like that. Can we get it a little? Adjust it off of all the parts that we're gonna have to paint. You're letting Daddy sand off a little nub on him real quick, okay? <sighs> Is it rough? Are you tired yet? No? Are you ready to keep going? No. What's the blanket for? You're not cold, are you? No, I need it for Okay. Now, can you paint him blue? There's your blue paint and there's your brush. Mostly blue. Daddy, see it real quick. Yeah, you did a pretty good job of getting paint, put paint everywhere. Okay, stick it in the styrofoam right there next to the pilot. Okay, next thing, you're gonna rinse your brush off. Okay, stick it in the water, and swirl it around. See all the blue paint coming off of it? Yeah, rub it up against the sides, huh? Yeah, swirl it some more. It's an ugly paint. Yeah. All right, wipe it off on the paper towel. Just like that. And See how the paint comes off of the paper, on the empty. paper towel? Now stick your brush in. Rinse it around again. Okay, now paint it out on the paper towel. See how the blue comes out on the paper towel? You're getting the water and the brush, and the brush paints out on the paper towel. Gets rid of all the blue. Now can Daddy see it for a second? Yeah. You do it. Okay, I'll do it. Brush cleaner put on it. Not that this brush is probably good enough. This is a what? I want the ten brushes. Brush, ten brushes for five dollars type brush. Yeah, maybe it was ten dollars. Ten brushes for ten dollars. Okay, put some 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 of that on there. Let's work it all in. What is doing? What is that? That is brush soap conditioner. Brush soap this year? Conditioner. It's like people put in their hair. You don't put conditioner in your hair, though, do you? No. No. You probably won't do that till you become a teenager. I'm not be a dancer. Yeah, someday you'll be a teenager. Fortunately. Okay, you want to wipe it on the brush soap again? Mm -hmm. Wipe it on the brush soap. Get some soap on it. This moss. Okay, flip it over. Wash the other side on the soap. Just like that. Yeah, that's good. Okay, now let Daddy work on it just a little bit. We'll just dip it in some paint there in some water. And Daddy will put it up over here to dry. Okay, that's how you clean your brush. Alrighty, so next we are going to paint some more. You want to paint some more? Yeah. Okay, so um. The big 
Fuck the me number. Except five is flat green plus twenty one. Sky and XO sixty five. Okay, so it's a green. How about we just paint the interior green? That's not like a good plan. Now, now. I probably have a good green for that coming in the mail, but right now I'm gonna grab um some neon. Let's call it this color. You think that's a good color to paint the interior? It's a little darker than um, just a regular flat green which I think is what would happen if you made that mix. So let's get some more tape his out. One, his one. Hmm? His one. We're going to paint some more, we're going to paint some more on plain parts. Oh, Daddy didn't get enough tape that time. His one? His no, we're not going to paint the outside of the plane. We're going to paint these, these three pieces right here to make the interior of the plane. Mm -hmm. You can handle that. You don't want to do that? What do you want to do? You want to cut out the, the outside of the plane? Now it's a double cat. Okay. Well, you can cut out the outside of the plane. Hold on. Let me put the interior parts in the bin so we don't lose track of those. Okay. So here's what I want you to do. You take these snippers just like this. Okay. Hold on. Let Daddy show you what to do. I want you to snip right about here. Okay. Through the thick part of the screw. Can you do that? Maybe here. Yeah, it's pretty tough. Be careful. It's You're going to have to use both fans probably. So you got to close the snippers. The snippers are kind of big. Mm. Push hard, 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 hard. Can you do it? You almost got it. Do it. Push. You You're kind of scaring me, buddy. There we go. You got one. Now I'll cut this one over here. It's a little bit. Yeah, I know there's piece. a little bit stuck on. That's supposed to be that one. Cut that one right there. Oh, are you on the snippers part? Yeah, you're getting it. You're getting it. Cut it like that. Push hard. Okay. Then snip that one right there. The shard. Yep. Okay. Now we got that plane off. Now, you want to get the other piece off? Here. We'll, we'll take those nubs off in a second. Let's get this other one off. Oh, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. We're trying to avoid doing that. Okay. So now that it's off, we're going to come in here and we're going to step them off close. Just really, really careful like that. Okay. So we don't want to damage the plane. And then we're going to come back and we're going to sand off what's left. So you don't want to damage the plate. When you twist it off like that, sometimes you'll damage the plastic right there. Um, I'm okay. not damaged it real. Not real damaged. It's look quite good. It looked quite good. Okay, you want to sand? So see all these little pieces, all the little nubs that, that are left from when we cut it off? We gotta sand those off, okay? Mm -hmm. So you take your sanding stick. And you go and sand on those. Mm. Okay. Daddy will work on this one. Will you do that one? Whoa. Um, mean, mean that is too hard for his one. Is too hard for his then one. Hey, well, let's trade. You sand on these. The daddy got down nice and close, and daddy will cut these off closer. Okay.
Did you just drop a piece? No. What did you drop? Um, did you heard something drop. Is it? Oh, it's swing off of your other plane. I mean the, the wheel. Why don't you drop it? Um. Why got the wheels in there? The for one the wheels. Why my Broken. Yeah, one of the wheels is broken. We're missing a piece for it. Okay. Daddy needs to get some and here too. Some sprue or something so we can fix that. Actually, you want to work on fixing that plate? No, not today. Not today. You want to work on this? So those are the two fuselage halves. Does that look like a Spitfire body a little bit? Mm. Just no paint. Mm. Mm. No, no paint. Mm. Let's put this back in the box now because we don't need it for a while. Okay. Whoa! Daddy's chair just went way down. It got caught on your chair. He got short. That was funny. Why that dirt? Because the little lever that lets Daddy's chair down got caught on your chair and it pressed it, and Daddy got short all of a sudden. What the go? I've got an idea. I know how to fix. Maybe how to fix your plane. Can you find the wing quicker? You the um, wheel that dro dropped. Can you find the wheel, and Daddy will um try and use a toothpick to fix your wing. Or your party wing that you will. Okay. Let's see if we can make a fix for this thing. So this got broken the other day and uh, well part of it was lost in the process of being broken. Me my two wheel bands. Did you lose the wheel completely? No, I see it down here. No, well, I had to have gone down there somewhere. Not see it. Did not see it? Well, it dropped. So it's down there. I heard it go. Where? You don't know where it went. Maybe down there. Maybe it went away? Well, it's possible. Mm -hmm. Did you check in your blanket? Make sure it wasn't in your blanket. There are date. There are date blanket. That's my blanket. It's my only bit. Your blanket. Okay. Well, we got to find it if we're going to fix this plane. You want to fix your plane? Mm -hmm. You don't want to fix it? Not today. Why, you, why not? Why don't you want to fix it today? It's building plane day. It's building plane day. You want to build Spitfire? Down the Spitfire. Like his Spitfire. Like that Spitfire. Okay. I know my tactics to distract you from the Spitfire are not working. But that will work to get you some landing gear on your plane. Just like that. We'll put some super glue. We'll glue that together and you will have um, some landing gear back on your plane. So you can go break it again. Let's get a little box and put that in a little box so I don't, that way we don't lose those parts too. Can you, put, can you put those parts in the box? This part right here and that part right there. Yep, I'm going to put the cover on the box.
That's not the right piece, it's this piece here. This is the piece that Daddy made to replace that part. How do we? It goes into the bottom of the wing. I'll show you later when we find the um when we find the wheel, but we gotta find the wheel. Okay? Okay. Just put that back off to the side. Alright, so the next thing we need to do is we need to paint the interior green. You ready to paint stuff green? Okay. Let's leave this here so we don't get um, green all over Daddy's desk. We get some toothpicks and a little bit of white, white tacky stuff. Because you know what we use white tacky stuff for? What do we use white tacky stuff for? Digging and paint. No, I'm sticking stuff for paint. What else do you do with white tacky stuff? Do you ever steal Daddy's white tacky stuff? You know, then how come it ends up all over the house? And um, did be wrongy? Hmm? Did be wrongy? You see it be lonely? So do you take it when it's lonely? What do you do with it? Do you decorate with it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you decorate with it. Yeah, I think you decorate with it. All right. Have you ever decorated yourself with it? Mm -hmm. You have. I'm also my brain. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? We're making some pieces so you can paint them. Getting them ready to paint. Yes, it's the time for his. Up. Okay. Let's see here. Where's the bottom of this one? That one's the bottom. Okay. Do you know how Daddy would normally do this? What? He would put a little bit of paint in his spray brush and he would just paint it with spray brush. Where is it boring that one? Mm hmm? Yeah, with that. You want Daddy to do that or you want to paint it with a brush? I'm here. You're here? Does that mean you want to paint it? I'm here, down. Sounds like it's pretty shaken. It's okay. There's some pieces to paint. Let me get another piece of foam. Maybe not. Well, that'll be all right. We can stick another foam. Okay, so let's put some green on the palette. We'll give you a brush, and away you go. Okay. Okay. There's your brush. There's some green paint. And have at it. Can Daddy paint too? Yes. Okay. You take that, you start painting, Daddy will start painting. Painting. Get a little paint on your brush. And just start painting stuff. It's a base of paint. Hmm? Do you put it in a paint base? Do you put it in a paint? Do you put it aside? Do you put it there? I'm not sure what you mean, buddy. Look, I'm paint here and there. And did it all. Yep. Keep getting paint on it. I want You're paint, doing good. I want to paint there. I want to paint where? Uh, where the bone is. Bone? No, 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 no. Leave that on. That's the only spot on it that doesn't need to get painted. Daddy put that in a very special spot that didn't need to get painted. Because you can't see that spot when it's all put together, and there's actually going to be glue there, and the glue 
needs the plastic to not be painted for it to work quite as well. It'll work okay, but it works better if the plastic's not painted where it is. What goes our bank? Huh? This our bank. This is our bank. This is our bank. Do you want Daddy to finish that one? No, it's breaking. Oh, it's breaking. Okay. Oh, it's just breaking. Okay, switch it back on there for you, okay? Go back okay. to it. Mm -hmm. Um. Let's get out the, while you're doing that, I'm going to cut the control arm out. Oh, where is that? The control arm is a 36. And I win. Most likely when we get off camera, I will, um, and my new paints come in, I will spray oh, these oh, to the right, again. right shade of green. And fix it. And we can detail them as well from there. But for now, this will be highly entertaining to um, the most important person in this uh, endeavor at the moment. A24 is a side lever. That one's going to be an easy one to lose. That's enough for you. That's enough for me. Do you need some more paint? Are you good? And am I done? Um, pretty close. You want Daddy to finish it real quick? Mm -hmm. Are you done? See, we do a lot of painting when we're modeling, buddy. Is this you? Is one? No. That's why we do the snap type models for you, because we don't have to paint those. Well, we can, but we don't have to. Because they come pre painted. And the bow, to the, the thing one and dot, dot. Hmm? Me and the things are dot. They. These are neighbors or not our neighbors on us. It's our neighbors or us. It's our neighbors or us. What about our neighbors? No, me and the fisher. Me and the moon. Um, well, I doubt any of our neighbors are going to watch this movie. It'll probably be Grandma that watches this movie. And maybe if uh, one of Daddy's friends online might watch a little bit of it, I don't know. I want. You want to watch it? I want it, Grandma. One, one boy's mama watch it. Well, grandma watch will watch it. it. I'm sure grandma will watch it. Yes. With, with mom. With mom. With, 
No wood. Out. I know that. When you go to Grandma's house, you can watch it with Grandma. How's that sound? That's mean. Mean was Mom's house. Hmm. Mean was house. Mean was. At my mom, Mom's house. Yeah, at Grandma's house. Yep. How much? This is a seat adjustment arm I'm going to mount on a piece on a toothpick, but not attempt to paint it this way because I'm going to come back and spray the parts um, with the proper shade of green. And that one's so fine that I'm afraid having multiple coats of paint on it may be a problem. So this is Painting with William, is that what the name of the show is? Yes. Oh, I thought this was uh, walk modeling with William. It's a painting me and daddy. You and daddy. Painting me and daddy. Making paint. What are we making? What kind of plane? A ding ding. Hmm? A ding ding. What kind of plane is that? Remember? Yes, it's like mine. It's like your plane, yes. What kind? What's it called? A blocking thing. It's called a Spitfire. It's a Spitfire. Dying a Spitfire. Do you know where the Spitfires come from? What? They come from a place called England or Britain or the United Kingdom, depending on what point of history it is. What? Yeah. Do you know that Daddy has some friends in the UK? Uh-huh. Yeah? Is that who he talks to on the computer sometimes? Mm-hmm. Yep. Look. It's bigger. Look. It's stuck. Do you know the, the guy that um, commented on the last video you were in? Yes. He's not in the UK, though. What is it? He is in... Here? No, I think he is in Norway, if I remember right. I don't know. Norm, if you see this, um, where are you from? can't remember now. I should know, but I just can't remember. But anyway, yeah. Where are you? All right. So that's some brushes ready to dry out. Put the cap back on the um, brush cleaner that away um let's see here so we now have a painted interior we have a base coated pilot that's going to need a bunch more work um and how are you feeling about the whole modeling thing <laughs> you happy are you now, happy we're working on a spitfire now it's the outside Ooh, ooh. oh shoot you know what daddy almost lost them a piece of his model, itty bitty, itty bitty, itty bitty piece that he would never find again. What piece? It's called a seat control arm. What is that? That is this little piece right here. See how small that is? Mm -hmm. That is really small, isn't it? Want to do his? You want to do that? Where's his well, table? We're not ready to put that together yet. There's still lots to do before we can put that one together. Well, as you guys can tell, I have not succeeded in putting him off until um, my other Spitfire came, unfortunately. So we are um, doing the Tamiya. Oh, maybe it's a good thing. I don't know. We'll see when they end.
want to paint the dots. Tell you one thing. Paint a dot. These um water petals are much easier to do in plastic than um it looked like they were in uh, photo etch. in here. Hmm? I'll put the balls in here. I'll put the balls in here. I'll put the balls. Where's the balls it in? I'm not sure what you're talking about, buddy. Mean the balls. The balls? Oh, you want to put a ball in that? Okay, we can put a ball in that. are called ball bearings. Ball bearings. How put yep. them in? Okay. Here's how you put a ball bearing in into a bottle of Vallejo paint. You take the cap off like that. First of all, I want to make sure there's not one. In this one, there's not. Okay. So we took the cap off, right? Mm -hmm. Then you take this part and you push it back and forth until it starts coming out like that. Okay. And then you go. And you're careful not to tip the bottle over. Here, you can get a ball bearing out. Squeeze a ball bearing out. Can you squeeze a ball bearing out? Catch it. Catch it put it in. Okay, now we put this cap back in, like so. And then you put the top back on. Oh, no. And you shake it. Can you shake it? I'm here. Doing it. Doing the light on. Look. Oh, it's still running. It's just um, the laptop and the screen because it's been going for a while. We've been doing this for 47 minutes already. 47 minutes. Can you believe it? Mm -hmm. I figured you were making it maybe 15 minutes or something. But no, we're making it a long time, aren't we? A big done? Hmm? Did the big done? Done. Oh, I hope I didn't lose my um, rudder pedals and all of that excitement. The paint's all done. I think the paint's all done. No, the paint's not done. Yes, done. Uh, it's a painting to go, buddy. Uh, it's a uh, it's painting. Sorry. Okay. That's called matte varnish. That goes on at the end. And it makes it so it's not shiny. You know how some of the paint is shiny and some paint isn't shiny? His one? That's a not shiny paint. Huh? That paint's whole job in life is to be not shiny. Is it shiny? Nope, it's not shiny. It's called matte. If you it's want it to be done. shiny, you go get some of this other stuff. See, this is called gloss. This one's called matte. See, it says M matte there, M-A-T-T. -T. Oh, no. Matte, can you say matte? Matt, want to paint Matt, Matt makes it not shiny. So, like, see how this paper towel isn't shiny? That's called matte. Okay? Um, but see this bottle of paint? See how that's really shiny? It reflects stuff? That's called gloss. And this is gloss. Can you say gloss? Can you say gloss? Say gloss. Duh. Gloss. Say gloss. Duh. Gloss. 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 So sometimes you use this and sometimes you use that, right? Depending on if you want it to be shiny or not. You want to use that matte? Um, how about we paint matte on a spoon? You want to paint matte on a spoon? Maybe his? Hey, can you get that big box of spoons over there? We'll paint matte on a spoon. We're not going to paint matte on the, on the, on the fuselage, no. Box. In the spoon box, okay. Daddy's finally going to open the spoons. I'll paint the... I want to paint the paint. Do you want to paint the paint? Plain? 
Well, um, buddy, we have to practice the painting first. So we're painting. You're going to get to paint a spoon. Have you ever painted a spoon before? No, neither does daddy. So is that shiny or is that matte? Matte. No, it isn't. It's shiny, you silly. Shiny. It's gloss. It's called gloss. Actually, it's called satin. That finish is called satin. It's halfway between matte and gloss. Mm -hmm. Okay. So what do we do first? We have to have a place to put our paint, don't we? Do we have a place to put our paint? Don't see any places to put paint, do you? All right, let's get some paint painting in places. What's all that? This is tape. What tape? Masking tape. Not see that before. If you've not seen that before, if you just saw it, we were using it before to paint. When we were painting green, your green came on the map. In fact, you um, got a little extra green off on Daddy's desk there. Oh, it's got a bottle in it and it shook up. Okay, there's your matte varnish to paint on. Okay. Now let me get you a brush. Here, you use this brush. This is a good brush for you to use. Give me a second to get it wet real quick. It's so real, it's real. This is a really good William brush. What is it? Those are brushes that cost 35 cents. Daddy buys them at the hobby shop to clean his, his, um, his airbrushes with. So paint it. See how you got a big clump of paint there? Turn it over real quick. Let's look at the back side. So you got a big clump of paint right there. Can you wipe that paint with your brush and spread it around so it's not a big clump? Yep. See, that'll be a much better finish. See how it's thinner? You don't want your paint to be in a big clump. Okay, get some more. Put it on. That's right. I can already tell that that spoon is getting much more matte. And me too. You're getting matte? Well, hopefully you won't get too much paint on you. And it is non-toxic, but even so, we don't like paint on blades. Well, since we're here, um, let me keep advancing on taking parts off and getting stuff ready. Mom, Mom, ready to paint. Oh, you're done painting that already? Do you need another spoon to paint? You want a different color of paint? Mm. You want some black? What black? This is black. You want some black? Is that guy? Black will make the paint make the the um spoon really black. Make the spoon blacker. Make a drop of black. Okay, there you go. Have at it. Work. Instrument panel. Well, I know where the instrument panel is. I just got to get it off. What's that container for? That was for parts. It wasn't for X Wing parts. We have the container. Oh, you brought a bug stack of containers over here. No wonder we've got containers. Okay. So that's an empty container I can just use. Excellent. I'm going to put parts in it then. We are going to put a aircraft control panel in it. How? Yeah, he's gonna cut it off right now. It's two dolls. Hmm? It's two. Yeah, he used his nippers to cut it off, and then he's gonna use um a sanding stick to knock off the little pieces, the little extra pieces. Then me. And he's gonna put it in the box so he can paint it later. Maybe we will um, do some airbrushing at some point. I bet you would like airbrushing. I bet you'd like airbrushing a lot. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah. Oh, you painted that whole thing black, didn't you? You want a different color for your spoon? Or do you want to paint another spoon? Wanted how to paint. Hmm? Wanted how to paint. How to paint? You still have lots of paint. You have lots of black paint. You want to flip it over and paint the other side black? Okay. 
Okay, and need the voltage regulator, and then you have your SP6 and <laughs> I'm going to cut those out yet. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This Spitfire has got a, a openable door. I can put do it, but they don't tall. Chris is going to be so jealous. I don't have to cut the door out. Yes. On the bang. Not on the bang. In out the bang depths. Hold this. You done? I uh... Ta da! It's a masterpiece. It's a painted spoon. Not Ladies what? and gentlemen. Boy, I'm painted a spoon on camera. Are you ready to be done for the day? Nope. Let's close this video off, okay? You say goodbye to everybody. Bye. Say bye bye, wave. Bye bye. If you made it this this far, you're a saint. Um, subscribe. Bye bye.